I started Seapoint Digital all by myself in my kitchen, and it was really just consulting. I was working for Say It Social as they're doing PPC management for them. And um, I was bringing on small regional clients here in the state of Maine. Well, as we grew, we knew that we couldn't maintain a one-person operation. <clears throat> and uh, Courtney had just moved to our area, having been recently married. Um, she was looking for new challenges, and it just worked out as a good person to bring on as our first team member. Well, I've been here the longest, so I've seen a lot of the progress we've had, you know, starting off from working in Bill's Kitchen to now being in our new office, uh, which is the biggest office we've been in. So just seeing the different changes of how we've grown as a company, we've taken more people on, we've gotten physically bigger, it's just been really great. Yeah, so our first office was actually in the same building. Um, as may, some of you may know, we do miss our old whiteboard lighthouse. But um, yeah, our first office was actually right the next unit over in the same building. Um, and it worked for, I think we were there for like four years. It was, it was a little bit smaller of a unit, but we were a smaller team and um, kind of all worked close-knit at that time. When we were making the decision of whether we should switch from our old small office to the new one, I remember Bill was just like, here's the things we should consider. And one of the things that we were like considering was like whether or not we would use the new space enough. Like, is that something that would make it like worth it to go to a bigger space? And now looking back on that, that's hilarious because <laughs> we are all here so much and I think, yeah, it has brought all of us like together more. We are working re like remotely from home way less. And I think somehow it's had a bigger change on our communication because, because we're all here together more. Um, it just makes it easier for us to, uh, to work together. Yeah, I would say just in terms of the psychological impact that having a bigger and brighter and more work-friendly office has been really good for us. Our other office was fine, it, you know, but it was, it was very small, it was very orange, and it, it kind of felt like we were limiting ourselves psychologically. And, and making this move, I think, has impacted Bill in that he's like, we can grow! We have, we have all the ability to do that now. And I think for us, too, we really enjoy being in the office, I think we're more committed as a company to work less remotely and just be together as a team to have more team meetings because the conference space is available and to really take pride in ourselves and our work because it's it's just such a nice office that we have now. And it's I think it's just brought us so many things that we didn't realize would actually happen, um, that we can be really confident and really proud of ourselves and excited about moving forward and growing. And, and we've done that. Our work expanded when we started taking on HubSpot. And really, instead of just focusing on Google Ads or Bing Ads and that one aspect of PPC management, um, growing the team helped us grow the services we could offer. So having somebody who specializes in social media, having somebody who specializes in content development and copywriting, and having Courtney really, really focused in on account management, um, HubSpot as far as on a technical side, uh, it really gave us greater capacity uh, and capabilities to uh, take bigger, bigger clients and to uh, meet larger organizations' needs. Since I started working for Seapoint Digital, we have gone through so many changes. As far as, I think one of the biggest one is just our growth in our experience and knowledge of what works and what doesn't. Um, I think that each of us have really refined our own specialization within the company. I think that we know a whole lot more than what we even realize. We talk about, you know, like, oh, I don't do much here. I just. You know, I just do the writing, or, or Courtney's just like, I just do the HubSpot, the HubSpot stuff. And, um, but, but I think, you know, when I first started working here and, and seeing what Courtney did and our capabilities with using HubSpot to market, it's just grown exponen exponentially um, in what we can do, how we can target people. 
Um, we've learned a lot. We've failed a few times. We've succeeded really, really, really well. I think beyond our wildest expectations, honestly, to be able to win national awards uh, with both Pima and the HubSpot Growth Award has been amazing for a tiny company like ours. And it just makes me really proud that, that we've been able to accomplish so much and to really to love our jobs and be committed to what we do and committed to each other and to our clients. It's just, it's really great. I think the most interesting thing for myself as a marketer is I'm a very inquisitive person and uh, I love the nuances of digital marketing. Like why does this system work the way it does? Why does SEO work the way it does? What's the best software to use for a particular challenge? Um, I think for me, kind of the most interesting thing as Seapoint has grown is not to try to micromanage every single different aspect, but really trust in my teammates um, to know what they're good at and uh, to let them uh, really excel in their specialties and to really focus on the overall growth of the agency and really look at overall strategy for clients. Our new office is great. Uh, it's not only the actual office space has given everybody more room to spread out, having a new conference room inside the office versus using the office building's communal conference room has been great um, for better utilization. And our photo video studio down here with beautiful backdrops allows us to really talk about our message in a video format and that's something we didn't have the ability to do um, to this extent earlier. And just to have the setup to come down here and talk about what we need to talk about. I think it's made everything a little bit more peaceful. It's not quite as chaotic having everybody on top of everybody. It's been really nice to just, everyone has their own space, they can spread out, or they can come together and work in groups. Yeah, it's just, it's been a, a very happy vibe being here in this new space. And I think it's made a bigger impact on Bill. I think his old office, we used to always be like, we need to get something up on these walls for him in his old office, and that never happened. Um, and his new office is so beautiful and so him. And I think he's really happy in there. And we like seeing Bill happy. And so we're glad he has it. The thing to me is, I don't want to grow just for the sake of growth. Uh, it's easy to try to go out and get as many clients to get your company revenue to a certain point. But it, for me, it's a case of having the right client base, um, having the right team members here at Seapoint. Um, we're a really tight knit group working together. And um, you know we've retained most of our team members over a five year period. Um, with very little churn. Uh, you know, I've known a lot of agency owners and I've worked with a lot of smart people in the industry over the last few years. And growth is not always a good thing if you're just looking at the agency bottom line. Uh, I want to grow C-Point that we continue to do excellent work, we continue to win awards, and really make our clients happy. I, I don't really want to grow to the sense of just bringing on new team members or getting a certain amount of retainers, um, if, if that means that the work that we do isn't going to be the best work we can do for our clients.